just as they've been shot like an arrow, I suppose, right? They look pretty good to start here. Building a lot of phases here. And there is the try in goes Jack McRogers. And just like that, a little over two minutes into the match, and the arrows come out with the first five of the night. Line out that rolling ball was very hard to defend. Okay. They decide to go the conventional route. There is the rolling mall trying to push this thing in. And they continue the push. It spins, it winds, the body's tied up. Came out of there. It's picked back up by the arrows. They are close to the try line. You have to ground it, though. And they blow the whistle. And they say it's in. On the tall timber. Still, they keep it tight. Now comes to the back line. Lovely step. Is that ball over? Yes, it is. Try award it. Rumble again gets it away. Oh, busting free beautifully. De La Vega throws it back in field. It's a stunner. This is the Toronto Arrows at their best. Jason Higgins gets the try. The Visitors. Arrows. And here we see the little break off the turnover. And a little bit of a mismatch there. Running into Matt Jensen. Adams comes to the back ball. The sword feeds it back on the inside. Again, looking for a bit more width over the top. There it is. Took a lap. Held up, thrown back in field. Desperate defense from the Warriors. Still there, though, for the Arrows. Short. Just short of the line. The blue wave continues. Advantage. And they have advantage. Clock might beat them to it, though. Ball is on the line. It should be a try. We're going to check here. Yeah, I agree with you. Darling. Try awarded. And there it is. Yeah. Try number three for Definitely the Toronto. He didn't attempt to catch that one, Matt. Here's Quatrin with the throw in for Toronto. They call him the Q. As Toronto drives off that line out with a with a mall in there. Closer and it collapses. And another whistle. Mark, you mentioned earlier that there are plenty of shifty kicks that Toronto had already put on early in the match, even before that first try. You can see they're really taking advantage of the kicks here, putting pressure into their uh, into DC's it's half. Nice. And, uh, it's early days. They're a good enough team to, to have a great start, but yeah, we look to create some space around Threaten. All right, speaking of threatening, here come the Toronto Arrows again. Mieres gets it into Detroit. There's Deanna, who had a great try in the first half. He was all over the pitch. And there's a big break. Here goes Quattro. Put themselves up. So here's the try. Look at that, just carving through. That defense was left wanting. Lesage can't believe his luck. Beautiful step off the left for Toronto. They've got some good substitutions coming off that bench. There's Tuckalet. There's Higgins in at scrum half. Jason Higgins in for broad. There's Lesage. Had a try earlier. Toronto pressing forward into the try zone. Harris legend mark. Here you go with the replay. There's that ball to the ground. Not only the pickup, the half volley off the feet, but then the quick. And it spilled and turned over. Toronto again on attack. There's Lesage. Oh, a great pass to Tukalet. Back inside. It's going to be Higgins for the try. No other way to describe this. this. Weren't they quick to pounce as well? That pass right there. Miracle pass to the number 15, took a lead, and it was a mere formality to get into the 5 uh, position, the fly half position. Here's a good oh, break. No. Here's this your should, break. There it is. This should be Mr. Montero dotting one down. Here's what they've been looking for the entire second half, courtesy of Mr. Montero. A great player all around, but also the speedster. Right. He but you, you, you watch depth. it. He sets, up, he sets up the whole thing by taking the kickoff and holding his feet and, t and sucking in four defenders. And then he's back in support here. That's a very well-rounded well rounded try, all started by Mr. Montero. Owen had the ball there. Spun out, and the arrow's got a little bit of space here. Up the middle, they've got an opportunity, and they're going to take it in. 
as Tukalet takes it in for the try. Went up and through the post by Taylor Adams. Here's a look back, Colin. All right, quick ball from nine. Supports there over the ball, right out to the 10. And look at that, two forwards running in there. And the spot ball at the back, he's run this a couple of times. Spot ball, you got two forward runners in front. Oh, nice, nice play, play. great offload there, and a give and go two. play, and they're going to take in another one here. Toronto has come out razor sharp, and a nothing start for Toronto here, Colin. Yeah, another spot ball at the back, a dummy forward runner, and that was the spot ball at the back. The wing was just trailing, and then Lesage on the outside, support scores tries. He just runs on the outside, doesn't let the winger go alone, but he comes and falls him on the outside. Here it'll be triggered by Jack McRogers. Well executed, spun back by Brody. Adams gave it off now. Uh oh, through uh -oh. And a nice offload there, and Tukale with a nice offload as well. And the arrows on the move, and the arrows, Brody, and he is gonna second effort. Wow. And go and have him make the break. Let's take a look at it. Yeah. There it is, breaking the inside opposite the 12, and then the 15 coming out the outside in support. You got the winger. Both wingers on the outside in support. And the nine, I mean, just look at that. Support scores, tries in rugby. No, it's a good I think that was Stop Turner, it. nice Stop tackle. It. Tyler Rowland. Not much materializing there. This oh, 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 oh. Materialize right up the middle as Patrick Parfrey. Take another look at this whole it thing. It's just a skip pass where those that. two runners on the it's inside it's holds good. that it's interior good. defense. You see the two inside, and the the internal defense launches up in that first half, and they were inside of the five meter line in those situations. Saw so 21 there for Toronto. Jason Higgins. Spin it back there. He's into the match. Some speed here. Oh, oh wow. Nicely done. Oh, that is beautiful. Taken in by wow. Rogers. Two beautiful. Seattle territory, but look at that spot ball at the back, splitting two defenders. Now the one to beat on the backside. He pulls the defender inside, leaves the channel. All men into the match. 31 point lead for Toronto. They give it away, and Toronto over the halfway line. Can they get away? Broke one tackle and a huge chunk of real estate. Toronto now they're back into business. A little bit of space on the outside here. Seema tried to get the tackle. They offload it to Higgins, and Higgins dots it and puts it down. And Toronto made that look very easy. We look back here at that scoring sequence. <laughs> oh my gosh, wow. look at that. What a gift. Step right through the passing lane. That's the big number eight, Diana. And he just rumbles through the big man, stretches his legs and high step it. But the support was there, moving to the outside. And look at that inside runner. A lot of times players won't fall. Faked out Seema there. And Rumble trying to rumble his way over the try line. Strong run. Right there, nothing yet. Go line, go line. Sorry, I'll push up. It's okay, let it come. Go line. Go line, boys. There's the ball and a heavy shot. And over the line, and it is put down there. And the arrows cash in again. That's kick. Gets it out to Adams. There's a crash from Pelfrey to took a let, took a let. Right up the middle into the posts, and it's a try for Toronto, just like that. That's watching was behind the screen, the wing that was out the back door, but instead they hit right up the middle. They had been using those runners out the back often early. New York probably bit on that runner out the back a little too hard. Look at that, Matt. And there's Montero there on the far side against Hume, and it's no match. That's a try for Toronto. Yeah, you've got the 5'9", Luke Hume versus the 6'4", Montero. On that play, that's a mismatch. And they took full advantage of it. And there's a try just like that for Toronto. Dylan Fawcett standing there ready to rock. And there's it. Try into the try zone. And just like that, Toronto. Not even position to catch it. That looks like Montero. We talked about the runners out the back for Toronto. Here it is. Bang, right out the back, little short runner, one one in hard at the line, and then that allows Montero to just... And it's charged down by Shepard on the exit kick, and it's gonna be a knock on, it's not gonna be a try, Mike Petri. Falls on it, and in goal, and so we can have a try. Yeah, try. Oh boy, this is a big turn of events, this is a knock, they'll keep the ball and play on. There's Adams, into Ben Lesage, Ben Lesage with a burst up, he's got a man on the outside, and it's... 
a try for Toronto. Another try. And that's Mieres on the outside. And then used Mieres to the outside. So let's look at this. There he is out the back. Troy Lockyer just getting caught a bit in no man's land. All of a sudden then that opens up that opportunity for Lesage to just exploit that. And then we're over the top with a pass into Take the into the training session this week. There he is having to make a tackle on Thomas de, La, Thomas de La Vega who gets it into Montero's hands. Montero heard you, Mike Petri. He says he wants to be man of the match with that try, and that's a hat trick. Well, knows where to be, knows when to be there. Toronto now putting the New York scrum again under all kinds of pressure. Andy Ellis missing a tackle there. Luke Hume coming okay. in, can't tie the ball up, able to get their hands free and offload. And again, 62 for Adams, and the next one on the list as Ben Lesage, our, our man of the match, takes it and can he get it all the way in no but he gets it to his teammate who dots it down toronto again that looks like jason higgins lead here's lesage mike look at him go up the pitch looking looking for his fellow teammates presence of mind and right there higgins brody trying to dig it out gets it to his man right in the middle there by cole keith out wide now We've got some room. Uh, nice tackle on Massage. Nice. New Orleans fighting for their life here again. There's the big fella. There's Montero. There He's it got is. it. He's got it. Hits the first try of the day, delivered by who else? Manuel Montero, La Pantera. Yeah, good use of the football. Here's the here's the finish, but the buildup was, you know, using the edge both ways. Ball moved across the field on the right side. Nice recycle by Ross. Back Paul Mall that stagnated. Stay up, Eddie, stay up. Arrows keep pushing, New Orleans. Now it's, now it's gone again. Arrows got some momentum here now. Yeah, they've got a nice little wedge here. They're moving, Nola Gold defenders are sh sh shedding away. Watch this now, looks like they have numbers That's outside. That's beautiful, step back inside. That's Mirez, That's, that's top. over to Montero for the try. Yeah, that's top drawer stuff. I mean, Mirez in front of them. Yeah. Watch, watch, watch Mirez's left foot step here on. Boom. Right there. Just bl right by Tim Moppin. Nice play by T Hanno Dirksen coming over and cover, but no one there. An equalizer. A bit of a mistake there, but that's who you want with ball in hand. If you're Toronto, charge down. And there's your answer moments later. That ball winds up in the loving arms of Mike Shepard. Uh, without actually taking the time to look. Lincoln, you said it, Carl say, dancing a bit too much. Should have put boot to ball previously, got around Brode. And then just heads up play from the 6-4 second rower. Charges it down and dots it down. Does Same mistake. Now trying to track down a little 50-50 effort. Lana had numbers. And it's just an unfortunate hop. Will it be another bounce that goes the way of Toronto? Great quick work to the breakdown opportunity for the Arrows. They've got support out wide, and this is elementary. Taking a 75% percentage. You see it right here. Can I interest you in three on one? Now, oh, fantastic stuff. Gaston Midas, the Uruguayan, unselfish, finds the offload to Lesage, but right there he cuts in. The defender there into a wide open so far to finally welcome the Sea Wolves home. Yeah, the Sea Wolves finally back at home there. Starfire and Tuck Willa. Toronto has numbers and an opportunity here. The final layoff. And still waiting for the indication. Fans, that's a try. And Toronto. it is another look here. And you take another look. Good ball outside, collected by Lesage. Then on to Levas. Levas, that final offload, and Minas does the rest. Van Voet on his shoulder, but that wasn't going to stop him. Van Voet there just a bit too late. Tries to fend him off, and realizes he's got enough to get to the track. Another four meters to go. And right through, no one picking up Tommy De La Vega, and that is one. We'll take another look at the try from De La Vega. Right through, no one there. Do you see the hands up from Jeremy Misalikalu? Well, who's going to get it? No one is the answer. Right through, just unofficially in this first quarter completed, and Toronto 
has been in Houston's end the most, almost the whole game, and they're trying to get into the try zone. It's Montero, and he's going to do it. The big man. It was just a matter of time if they were that close with Montero available to get the ball, Grant, and they do. You know, the Toronto Arrows had frustration after frustration after frustration, and the Sabercats might be able to say, hey, we held them out for a long time. Maybe, maybe that's a momentum swing. And it all depends on what happens behind the post. And have been so this entire first half. Leaving Toronto frustrated, but it looks like Toronto going forward into the try zone. Is it De La Vega? It good. And it is a try. Quatrin. Yep, and there's uh, De La Vega there. Leg pump. He's got. He, yep, and he's got. Sabercats up to the task. Look at that camera work. You could see them all just being defiant in those black jerseys. Just trying to force yeah, his way in. It looks like he's in, and it is De Deanna, I believe, with the try for Toronto. Coming off of here, and yeah, McRogers got the got the latch on, and he just keeps that ball right down low, sees the line, gets it dotted down. Toronto just need to settle their phases, keep possession. Can they work? Flash ball, beautiful space. Here they go. Adrian Wadden, Wadden for the line. It's a stunner. Adrian Wadden. Scores one of the great lock forwards try, and he's absolutely delighted. And why not? It was a thriller. What a beautiful staff wants to see. This is what the player has been hoping for. And beautiful line, no doubt about that one. The space opening up superbly. Wadden busting on the scene. First quicker possession for them to break down the New England defense. Excellent dummy throw. That's Taylor Adams. The laser gets it away. Great skill. The Sarge on the outside, cutting back in beautifully, looking for the line. They're over. As slippery as black ice. And took a lead. Beautiful job. And booted here by Iglesias. Arrows underneath it. Gathered in by Tukalet. Tamirez offload there. Charging ahead. Yanked down. Higgins got it free. Tight corners over there, and the Arrows, they've got some room. Toronto trying to take this one in late in the first half, and Tuchelette will do it. He takes it in, the dot down there, and it's a 16. Play down the blind side. Look at this handling under pressure. All the ball goes across. Great, great um, offload by Levas, and then good support by Tuchelette to be able to finish that. But you've got a team. Josh Ferno. Added here in the last three, four weeks to the San Diego club, a part of it in the past. He and Patty Ryan making a difference. Now Toronto, they've got an opportunity here with a short field. And the offload and a beautiful one right into the hands of Gaston Mirez. And Toronto counters just like that. From that turnover, look, look the ball comes right. Fens comes through, steps inside. Like Mirez doesn't have to do anything. All the work by... The, actually, it's, uh, um, I think that was flashed. Brody finds it, trying to find a seam. Good footwork out of him. As they're knocking on the edge of the five meter are the arrows. Spun free to the outside. Opportunity here. Some room up the touch line, and there they get it into the hands of Levis, who missed the opportunity. And, Atlanta, and here's a look back, and it's a seven-point match. Here's the try, Pete. Well, beautiful play by Mieres to be able to hit that hole. Draw Iglesias, put Levis away. The ball, and you see the Arrows platform, they're very flat. Mirez comes in off the wing. There's the crash. Now they'll go again. Diana. Stay there, stay there, stay there. Well met by Halai. Quick hands. Oh, there's numbers. Took it, let. Took it, let. The Argentinian oh. superstar. Easy ball. And at Mierez, first receiver off the corner there, it gives Will Kelly an opportunity to stand outside. Now there's an extra attacker on the right-hand side of the field. Open side right there. The pass goes out to Tuchelet. Lots of gaps there. And you see Brayton Bob. 
Wide pass, quick hands, Lesage over, rolls and dots it down. Benny Lesage is basically defending all night. Haven't seen a lot of line breaks, haven't seen a lot of ball in the hands of Jones and Lesage. And it's a good combination as we see it play out on the screen. The majority will stay together next year. Surviving this, coming out the other side with some positives like this right here. As they pick up another try, this time Mitch Richardson, his first touch is a good one. See, Don Bryan can be used next year. Well, classic midfield move here. You see, the fly half starts directly behind the scrum, goes to the right, freezes the defense. Toronto trying to find something, a little kick through. Right back to Dirksen, read it well, charged down. Here are the arrows with an opportunity. Lesage across and down. The co-captain ties things at five. And points are going to be really, really important. You can see Lesage. The interesting thing is that when you go to a kicker, you need to know what their primary kicking foot is, and that's Dirksen's right foot, and you can see Lesage covering the right foot with that block. He puts his hand back, hand up. Just outside the five meter mark. Kelly, little stab kick through. Mides giving the chase, he's got it. Try time Toronto, Will Kelly to Gaston Mides. We will take our final hydration break. 12 all between Toronto and Nola. Stick with us. Yeah, yeah, we'll fight it. Oh, beautiful work there from New York. And just as I say that, they turn it over. Ball spills loose, and again, opportunistic are the arrows. They will reclaim the lead as Tuchelet will dot it down. Oh, and Tuchelet able to dot it down. You take another look, and there it was, just a mishandle. Adams on the spot. Great support line run by Tuchelet. Found him, and Tuchelet in for five. They've been playing on this artificial surface all season long, so by now they know how that egg Fine. Fine. Use it now. Let's go. And again. Hey, what's up? Come on. Uh, the hooker, McRogers. And there's the look that Toronto needed. Mike Shepard. One, two from the 32-year-old lot. You see him right there, number five, on the spot. Just enough space, unable to get the tackle. And a converted try between the posts. They thought New York was guilty of rolling a couple of times with that ball. Uh, Toronto does finally get it back out on the wing. Eyeing the try line. Oh, over the outstretched fingertips and secured yeah, you, you by Mitch Richardson. What an offload. What an offload. Look at this from Tukulet. Somehow able to get it up and over McManus. And the arrows are back in business. Conversion pending. Then we'll likely have our hydration break. Looking for their first try of the afternoon. They go around the right-hand side again with the forwards. Ferguson spins. Ferguson's over. The sneaky little number nine uses the goalpost to his advantage. And Toronto, they'll get their try. Starts from the line out. We talked before about the forwards and the experience there, and that's where you want to go. That's your breadbasket right now if you're Toronto. Start with the forwards. couple phases here and Ferguson he's gonna fake the pass out and then just spins out of Mungo Mason's grip
Rogers to Delavega, the man who earned the penalty. Down to Ferguson. It opens up for Ferguson right down the middle. Chip over the top. He needs to bounce. Tussie Taylor, who's opposite number, flying through as well. Oh, Ferguson! Oh. Ferguson has stolen one from Tussie Taylor. What an individually brilliant piece of work. Up the first gap, and that's only the first bit of brilliance from Ferguson there. The fake, everybody goes sliding out and then this chip over the top it looks like Tusitala is good for the chase and it just hops kindly into the hands of Ferguson you never stop you never quit and Ferguson the absolute illustration of why perfectly weighted look at Tusitala he looks like he's got him by a step Montero's on the field now. Hard to miss in the 22 jersey. Oh, great pull from Adams to Tukalet. Back up to Dutois. And the Arrows, they are shooting straight here in the second half. They will take the lead. Make the pass, but he's got heat on him. Watch this, the shoulder that comes into Adams while he's passing this ball. He gets clobbered, but it's a perfect pass. And then off the ground to Dutois. Watch again. Boom. Ball's already away, though. Robertson thinks he's got a clean shot. On FS1 here. They have the advantage off the scrum, too. Adams again to the line beautifully. Oh, the offload to Malcolm. Malcolm. He will race to the line. Well, he's known as Sammy the Boot, but both feet were firing there for Malcolm. Another five points for the Arrows. This is just a beauty. Adams, great flat pass here from the center. Could have been a little forward, Dan. Yeah, yeah, get us rolling. You got uh, 30 seconds. This bullet from Adams. Yeah, seven. And then it's Dutois. Higgins, quick hands. Manage is over. Higgins wants the ball. Little pass up for Higgins. Can he reach out to the line? Higgins. The free jack swarm. That's great stuff. One handed grab in the rain there from Higgins. Get on side. Difficult pass to catch. Well, that's that's De La Vega there. Watch the hands here. De La Vega off the ground. Higgins with the one-handed catch the off the boot laces. I waited a second, sorry. Montero taps quickly, little space for Montero, throws the dummy, the big fella. Montero still going and finally links up with Tukalet. Your queen Tukalet will dot that one down. Arsenal, besides a bunch of guys that are just refusing to give up on the field, is that they do have some of this international flavor here. Man Manuel Montero. Goes quickly. Joe Johnson's got his back turned. Space in front. Tired arms. Conradi can't make the tackle. And Tukalet on the trailing line.